dishes in the sink, me back to bed, maybe get some reading done. You're not going to say anything to Adam, are you? No. What happened was between the two of us. We didn't mean for it to happen. We didn't want to hurt anybody. Can it be just between the two of us? All right, so he gets married in my life, remains sane and normal, so. Oh, Jimmy's lunch money? Oh, boy. What a delightful welcome home. Perhaps I should go away more often. Are the kids off to school? Uh, yes. <laughs> you know, I, I actually was uh, going to go back to bed and maybe catch up on a little bit of my reading. Uh, well, I read very well. Uh, would you like some company? I need some sleep. I didn't get very much sleep last night. I was sort of revved, so I stayed up and I just oh, did a lot of work. Oh, what you need is relaxation. Deep relaxation. Mm. It's very tempting. I'll rub your back from head to toe. Relax those aching muscles. Vibrate your bones. <laughs> it's very tempting, but... <laughs> but what? Kids are in school. The machine will pick up the messages unless you have a hot luncheon date with Phoebe. I think we have this house to ourselves till 3 o'clock. No, I'm, I'm not meeting Phoebe for lunch, but I am expecting my dear aunt at some point. Oh. When? Mm, Soon-ish. <laughs> Well, why don't we while away a little? Adam. <laughs> Come on. Well, how about a, a bubble bath for two sounds? Or how about a shower of rose petals? To help soothe your skin. Oh, these are amazing. Or oh, the glitter oh. of gems to light up your already Dazzling eyes. Oh, Adam. Oh, this is so beautiful. The jeweler said they were one of a kind. Oh, when you were out of town, did you, uh, did you buy a greeting card company? <laughs> you shouldn't have done this. But I'm so glad that you did. I'm so... Oh. It doesn't do you justice. You don't have to ply me with gifts, you know. You... Yes, I do. You deserve the riches of the earth. Hourly. <laughs> <laughs> now, what did you do while I was gone? I missed you. Well, of course you did, but I'm... There must have been something more to do than that. Ah, uh, well, I, um, I performed in the, um... In the circus, and uh, <laughs> I rode in the rodeo, and uh, I, uh, I went ice fishing in Michigan. Oh, uh, but even that couldn't diminish the off torment of missing me. That's right. I, I did go to Pierce Riley's um, gallery opening yesterday. Ah, well, that's why you couldn't sleep. Tormented by visions of junkyard art. <sighs> you know, <laughs> he... Uh, he did very well. He, he was received very well. <laughs> Pine Valley's a regular feed for the Guggenheim. Adam, come on. You don't have to waste energy bad-mouthing Pierce. Yes, I do. I, en I enjoy it. I know you do. But it's obvious that you're jealous. And there's absolutely no need for you to be jealous. As long as you're available and he's available, yes. Well, he's not me. available, okay? He and Janet are getting married. Pierce and Janet are getting married? What inspired that? I don't know. I really didn't get a chance to talk to either one of them very much yesterday. 
For Israeli and Jen. Norman Rockwell weds Lizzie Borden. Janet seems very happy. Really? Well, uh, have they set the date for the nuptials? Well, I think it's probably going to be soon. They didn't seem to be able to stay away from each other. <sighs> Is that right? Well, they left before the evening was over, which I thought was rather odd because it was Pierce's opening. Yeah, well, uh, you know how it is with black magic. Urges that defy repression. I, I guess I should uh, an engagement present for the happy couple. <laughs> I think if you give Janet and Pierce an engagement gift, they're going to end up submerging it. <laughs> you, you don't think I should give them a present? No, I don't think that's necessary. After all the grief I put him through. Oh, so you admit it. Well, I was a mite jealous. A mite? Well, all right, all right, all right. The whole way, the whole nine yards. I would love to have banished him to the farthest reaches of the galaxy. Well, you can't blame me. The guy wanted to spend time with my girl. I wanted you all to myself. Don't you know that you've got me all to yourself? Don't you know that by now, Adam Chandler? You're the only one that I want. Is it not some sort of a cruel joke? Is it? Would I play games? Never have before. I never will. I love you. I love you more than I have ever loved you before. Oh, baby. All the things that have happened between us. All the stuff I put you through. Oh, you wouldn't be Adam Chandler if, if you didn't do that. Is this real? Am I awake? Ouch! It's real. I love you. Good. I can die now. <laughs> no, you can't die now. Oh. No, you can't, because I want you around for a long, you long time. You want me around? Yes. You want me around? You have made me the happiest man on the planet. What? Well, who was it exactly last night that made the announcement of this engagement? What? <laughs> Nobody. Nobody. Janet told Opal and Palmer. Why? Why? Well, it just isn't it the man that usually makes the announcement? Oh, uh, maybe. I don't know. I don't think Janet and Pierce follow Emily Post's rules, do you? Yeah, that's true. They're barely out of the trees. <laughs> well, what difference does it make as long as you and I are together again? Mm. Mm. Oh, good grief. I, seeing you like this, I totally forgot. I have an appointment. I'm, I'm about to miss it. Oh. Um, look, uh, well. can, I, can I see you again tonight? Make yeah. dinner? Eight yeah. o'clock? Yeah, I've it. Good. Don't, uh, don't bother changing. <laughs> It's about time. Oh. 